exciting Cyber Fun Day here at Bricks Minifigs. Wow, we have a lot of build sets out tonight. Oh my god. <laughs> Not that many lots, you're right, but every lot is open and built out of box. Yes. Some with boxes. So I hope you guys are excited. Uh, we have Creator Expert, City, Bionicle, Avengers, we have some Batman here. I think one of those is Elves. Um, we got some great stuff here tonight. Like a lot of this stuff we've not had here before. Like these over here, we've not had. Not had those. They've been here, but not yeah. like that. Um, just great sets. All these sets are practically certifiable and ready to go. Most have instructions. I think there's a couple that don't. No worries. But you guys know how it works. In order for you guys to claim an item here tonight, you have to put in the comments below, I claim lot number 1, 2, 7, 52, whatever the number is, for the exact price we have here tonight that you will see up on your window. And the first person we see on our end gets it. And starting tomorrow, when we open, till next Sunday when we close, you can pick it up, pay for it, take it home, play with it, Put it up on the shelf, dust it off every three months. I don't know. Whatever you want to do with it. Um, it is my weekend, so I will be here with our new staff member, Quinn. So come in and say hi. Uh, Ryan will be in sometime in the evening tomorrow, but just, mm -hmm. just for a couple hours as I host an awesome birthday party, which is going to be pretty fun. Quinn and I are going to be doing like a duo hosting for it. Going to teach him how that works. He was pretty good at it when I showed him the first mm -hmm. time, so... I'm not too worried about it this time. We do have a, a quick question uh, from Alicia asking about Series 22. But I guess it's time out if our, our open ones are coming in. They'll be um, here soon. We should have them hopefully in the next five days, is five. what I was told. Yeah. We'll have them. So we will, we will post it up on Facebook and let you guys know. And we will have an entire plate full yeah. of Series 22. We should 22. have three or four full series open on the base plate at least. Yeah. yeah. And they're going to be ready. Because, I mean, I'm still looking for one or two figures myself. So... Keep an eye out because we're going to post about it. Not only are, are we getting those, but we currently just got in this week some new custom minifigs that we posted up over the past couple days. Yep. Later on during the mid of the show, we will show them off. And please come in, see them in person, and I mean, take some home if you want. We got plenty of awesome ones. Yes, they're awesome. Awesome. All right. So I think we should get right into it because we have a lot of stuff there. Uh, is there anything in the comments or you have anything um, to say? Not at the moment, but to prevent us from freezing tonight, can you do me a favor and just make sure that both thermostats are set to 72? 72? Yes. If it went down, it might, it might still be okay, but we'll see. Okay, we're good then for now. We'll check it in a little bit. Yeah, they're good. All right. And, uh, yeah, I mean, other than that, we don't have anything special going on this weekend. Um, just going to be getting bulk out, minifigs. Oh, we do have a new layout of the store. Right. So, well, it's just a layout, but Not we moved some layout. stuff around. We so if you, guys, stuff. if you guys came in over the weekend, we have moved our Duplo. We have moved our castles and everything else over to this side. And we're going to be migrating. Oh, and our friends is over here, too. There's a ton of friends. Hey. I would show you more, but I can't yet. Um, <laughs> until after the show. 
Um, and then we have a lot of more of our superheroes and stuff that are in Star Wars that are going to be going on our blue wall. So we're moving stuff around a little bit over here. So if you guys have any questions over where stuff went, yes. just ask Dave or Quinn over the weekend. Yep. I'm getting used to it myself, so it's going to be new for everybody. So come on in, visit, say hi. I'll be here Monday as well, um, probably with Ryan back and forth. Other than that, uh, I think we're ready. Chris, yes. are you ready? Uh, Sarah's always ready, especially with her new cut and paste system. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, just so you know, Lou also hopped in here and says, Happy Super Valentine's Day Bowl weekend to everyone. You know, it's funny. Someone else commented earlier said happy or, uh, happy Super Bowl weekend. And I was like, what? <laughs> like, Super Bowl? Question mark? Yeah. Huh? It's because all the teams stink. Yeah. Forget about that. Yeah, Super was... Bowl. Schmooper Bowl. I just want to see the previews. It just means we're going to be a little slower on Sunday and all the restaurants and stuff are going to be a little more busy. <laughs> sure. I mean, whatever is by the project table is my goal. So. Yeah. Well, it's just then easier to, pull, to pick bulk. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Because there's a ton of bulk back here. A ton of bulk. I mean, technically, the bulk we have back here, people could go through and just have to have Michael, please stop. What are you doing? Hey. Hey. Michael. Go to mom. All right. Do you remember your job for tonight? Shh. Don't say it. <laughs> okay. All right, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to get right into it. Finally. All right. Here we go. Lot number one from Lego Creator 3 and 1. This here is the Daredevil Stump Claim. It is complete with all three instructions. This pretty good looking minifig here. And it's red, white, and blue. Um, almost cowboy esque uh, coat or jacket, however they want to pronounce it. And I mean, look at this. Look at this awesome biplane. This is smart here. Do you see all this bends? This this is real smart. Gives that curvature here. We it's got all sorts of flaps and everything else. Yeah, too. it's pretty nice. And tonight, you, tonight you can go home with this complete set here for twelve dollars. All right. Next up from Speed Champions, also a reference to Fast and the Furious. We have here lot number two. This is the two thousand eighteen Dodge Challenger. Uh, oh, I see. SRT, SRT Demon. Demon. Yep. And then the 1970 Dodge Charger RT. Look at this one. This one looks sweet. It's really sweet. And then you can take off this here. Yeah, you see how the engine is submitted out for that. Put a 2 by 3 tile over there. Yep. Boom, cover it up. And then it's got the starting line countdown. All right, Samantha Dabrowski is claiming lot number two. Well, all right. All right. And uh, Sarah, so tonight when you're doing that, can you just put the initial of the person who did it so it's easier for later? Thank you. Cool. All right. Well, this one is done and out of here. Chris, take it off. Let's go. Next up here, lot number three for all you farmers out there or you need something to, you know, process all their crops in your town here. We have this double duo pack here, the harvester transporter and the tractor. What's really cool is this. Just roll this down. Yeah, take it off. Yep. Snaps on. This here, this snaps here, and then this snaps it folds up. like folds a up. so. I know. Yep. I know. But I also noticed that if this is not working, let's say it's, you know, the engine's blown or something, then you could still clip this on here. You do that. <laughs> yeah, it's a, little, it's a little strange, but okay. I, well, well I Bob Simonetta is taking home lot number three tonight. They have, they have the C clips there. I mean, so congratulations, Bob. This is a perfect addition to your city that you're working on. Yeah, this is really cool. Works great. Look at this hay piece, guys. Look at this. It's a brand new two by two by two. Two by two by two thirds. Yeah. Plate. Brick, yep. Or brick. All right, moving on to lot number four from lot Lego Bionicle. We have four of the elders. So we have Rakama, Ratu, Nokama, and Winyu. Winyu. Winua. I'm guessing it's Winua. Yeah. Winua. Yeah. So all Win four of these you Winua. can get tonight for $45. Um, this is our newest one here. We've shown these other three off before. So it's cool to have another one in here. There's supposed to be six. It's not too bad. They're in great shape. If you're a Bionicle fan, who doesn't want the Elders? By the way, for you Bionicle fans, I have 
like 30 new masks in the shop, and a lot of them are rare. A lot of them. I mean, just one or two of them were like $20, $25. It's crazy. So if you're looking for Bionicle mask, come in this weekend or... Nick says he used to have... The, Nick Gundy says he used to have the blue one. This one? Yeah. If you're looking for Bionicle mask, come in, ask. I'll show you all we have. I got some great ones. All right, next up here from Creative 3 and one it is the Pirate Roller Coaster. This here is complete with five figs and an awesome Long Shark Roller Coaster. Woo! It is pretty awesome. All kinds of features here. Wrecked pirate ship, a little squid, cannon that you could take off and shoot water at the passengers while they go up and down. Woo. Uh, we do have a question from Kurt. It says, uh, for lot number one, what are the other two builds that you can make? So, uh, lot number one. You have the biplane, which we showed. We have a nice little speedboat, racer boat, and, and a little and jet racer. Rocket plane. Yeah, they're pretty cool. I like the boat. The boat's pretty nice. So there you go. All right. Back to the coaster. Oh. So yes, it's cool because it has a nice little like destroyed pirate ship in here, which is kind of like a callback to the Pirates of the Barracuda Bay set. Ah. Little parrot, uh, which is kind of cool because the wreck is actually on the roller coaster. And then this is a callback to the Ar Armada set from Pirates, um, whereas the the yellow and white, and then they actually expanded out to make it bigger. Um, and then of course the control um, tower. the control tower and the turnstile go through that, along with the roller coaster. With this little water feature that it can pop up and, and down and everything else too. So have some fun with it. Yeah. With the splash it's cool. action. It's pretty cool. It's got a lot of features. It's great colors. Kurt is going to go ahead and claim lot number one. All right. Lot number one is claimed. Kurt Walker okay. taking lot number one. The pirate roller coaster can be yours Oops. for $90. 90. Oh, uh, Bricks of Lima is asking, what else can the roller coaster be? Um, You know what's crazy is I. It's all one big book. It's right there. Right here. So there's a little roundabout, and then it's like um, it's, it's a another view. coaster. It's yeah. a, it's it's more like the uh, vertical velocity kind of. almost. It's a back and forth roller coaster. Yeah, so they're they're pretty with extra cool. extra stands there. So it's, it's a good set. It's a nice little addition if you're trying to do a pirate themed amusement park, which would be kind of cool, honestly. <laughs> yep, yeah, was part of their whole roller coaster thing. They did it with city with a uh, creator and, and a little friends. blue cart balloons. And when you're bored, you could just, you know, suck on some helium. <laughs> Been there, done that. <laughs> All right. All right. Letter six. Here from Creator 3 and 1. Oh, I didn't realize I had these back to back. Oh, well. All right. Lot number six here. We have a duo set. So we have this 3 and 1 plane that could be a helicopter and a jet. Or you can get this 3 in 1 rocket semi carrier. Which also could be a little camper and a flatbed heli. Yeah, flatbed heli, heli pad almost. Yeah, it's nice. And what's cool too is this opens up and there's a little bitty satellite in here. Do -do 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 -do. Pretty cool. Yep, and the shuttle comes off. It can launch yeah. all, all sorts of right. stuff. See? Yeah. Because it's on wheels. Pretty nice. I found the piece I was missing earlier. Yep. So I've got that all set. And of course, you're playing. And tonight you can go home with both of these sets here. For $23. All right. Next up here from Lego Avengers, based off the Square Enix video game, we have here the Avengers Truck Takedown. This is complete. Two AIM agents, one with a rocket jetpack. Captain America, Hawkeye, by far one of the best Hawkeyes I've made with the purple. And then this drone actually comes right off, so technically it's another character. Actually, both of these can be because they're automated because AIM is advanced idea mechanics. And then you could prop this open and launch out this sweet stud shooter. And then these are supposed to be like arms. Sure. Oh, I mean, all right. Tonight you can go home with this lot here. Lot number seven for $40. Yep. Barbara Dombrowski is taking that one. Sweet. It's a good set. All right. 
Next up here from the Dark Knight Trilogy, it is the minifig semi-scale tumbler. Probably, and I was talking to Dave about this before, this is totally the coolest little tumbler. I, I haven't seen it built before, but it's cool. I actually had to fix it when I came in. Um, but it is such a cool little tumbler. It's it's amazing. It's the right size. Almost. It's, it's almost has room for two on the inside as it should. Um, unfortunately, it doesn't have a little motorcycle that shoots out of it like the movies. Um, but it comes pod. with this exclusive scared Batman or demon-esque Batman head. The silver teeth. Yep. Tonight, you can go home with this complete tumbler set here for a whopping $40. Forty dollars, not bad. Not yes, bad this comes with with the uh, instructions and extra parts. Yeah, extra studs and everything. They, they did the set so well. I mean, these do these double wide fatty tires on there, like it's, pretty dope. it's great. Yeah, I think it's better than the bigger one. Of course, the Joker and stuff is better with that one, but this is probably the I mean, the best the playable only, tumbler that you I mean, can get. Of course, I'm gonna have gripes about it, but I mean, this head could have been molded instead of printed. Yeah, but I wouldn't. I wouldn't even worry about that anymore because I forgot that they were just gonna figure that out when we to pick it up. Yeah, this should have been molded instead of printed, and I wish it was slightly bigger with a bat pod. Like I would have paid sixty bucks. I would have paid sixty bucks. Yeah, what are we gonna do? But oh well. Next up here from the Lego Ninjago movie, we have here the Ninjago City Chase. With extra police scooter, uh, I, I forgot what their name of those are called. Yeah, there's an actual name to this. Yes, but tonight you could go home with this set here for $28, and it's complete. We got the figures Nia, Lloyd, a cop, we have the little sales guy, and one of the Garmagun crooks, Shark Army guys. It's yeah, pretty nice. Yeah, we've had this here a couple times. But this time we have a box and instructions. What? And the dark green apples, which is pretty And cool. Jordan Wilner is going to claim lot number nine. All right. Congratulations, Next Jordan. Tuck, tuck. Thank you, Lou. It's a tuck, tuck. Thank you. He's totally right. Yes. All right. Next up here from Lego City, we have the Airshow Jet Transport. Two minifigs, awesome flatbed. Look how sweet this jet looks. Look at that. I really like how they did use these little flaps mm -hmm. and put those on the bags for the exhaust. And what's nice is it actually fits really, really easily into the trailer. It literally just plops in, yep. which is great. And you get this crate in the back here. Full of tools. Tools and, and the things. directional lights. Two mini things. I will say, if you want to show this off, it's one of the coolest things ever. Is they have this little air mask with a molded helmet that goes around it. Mm -hmm. So it's actually, I don't think it's in many sets at all. No, it's not. It's in the new city line. And I think it's pretty dope. I think it's awesome. Yeah. The, the new city line that this came out with is all based off like jets and air. And Tim Preboy is going to take lot number 10. Congratulations, Tim. All right. Next up here from Lego Elves, one of the rarest lines in Lego we have. Nadia Spa Secret. I don't get that. Spa Secret. Shouldn't it be like so Secret Spa? So Nada, I think is her name. It's, it, and it's Spa Secret because there's a secret of the what's waterfall. behind here. Yeah, the waterfall thing. Um, because the, the map falls out like that. That's the secret. It's not like it's her secret spa. Yeah. Um, there's also the little book that pops out of here as well. It's like a little diary with some stuff in it. Yeah. Um, and the thing is that's cool about the set is that um, I actually put the set together, so it is 100% here with the extra parts, extras, um, and we did not put on any of the decals, so you can put on all the decals yourself. Sarah told me I should do it, because I'm awesome at it, the but they are in the, in the book. The book. It should be on the very front page. They were on the front page. Where did they go? I didn't know there were stickers to this. There are stickers to it, and they were with it. Find him, Dave. Find him. <laughs> this is how it was sitting there, so. They shouldn't be. Huh? They should be in the yeah, book. The only stickers I saw were on a friend set that we'll show off later. Yeah. Oh, there, oh, they there, there they are. There. See, definitely not the first page. Well, I, I put them in the first page normally. I don't know who put them in there. I always put them in the front. 
But yes, Nada's spa secret with instructions in box, 100% complete for $30. It's pretty yes, cool. and the little purple top. Like with the elf, elvish print on it, by the way. This is mm -hmm. a unique one to the set. Yeah, any of the elf animals have like an elvish thing and lines on them it's their like emblem or something Don't just... all right next up for lot number 12 from lego city this is part of this see this is the this is the crookedness i'm talking about previous space line this here is the shuttle launch set rocket assembly and transport look at this you get all these minifigs this little research robot you get this awesome little dual molded rock that comes in a couple different colors. Well, let's show up the figs first. This, yeah, this set comes with seven minifigs plus the robots, so it makes eight. You have the little space figs, of course the launchers and everything else. You have the nice space lab, which is for the rover, which Steve's pulling in right now. Right. Well, so it's the rover space Prop it lab. up and then it gets fixed up, welded, whatever it needs. Updates. Diagnostics checks. Yeah, diagnostic checks. You have the launch center over here, which is pretty easy. Nice, Did you notice nice, that these were stickers of like them checking the area and from Mars, yeah. yeah. And of course, you get your Loading little truck. loader truck, and, and then, then you have your gantry awesome. crane and the rocket. And then, if we put this a little back, yeah, I got it. Yep, the rocket actually tilts up to launch, mm -hmm. and then you can take it apart. So all you got to do is take off these two by two tiles here, and then you could separate it. Um, oh, right, there are two, by on the two tiles on the bottom. Yep. I forgot about that. Boom, separate it. I think all these could be separate too. And then, yes. And, then and that should come off the top. This comes off, but there's actually an open space. This for the, is, right, for the rover. For the rover. And then you can separate this. And then this lands on the space shuttle, uh, um, the space center, the thing on the other side that you can buy multiples of and hook them together. Yeah. So that'll actually dock with it. And what's really cool, cool too is you can hold two people in here. <laughs> cool. It's great, great line. This, this space line was awesome. And honestly, it could go pretty well with the newest space line that Lego's got slowly coming out. Yes. And this one does come with all of its books. There are six of them total. Six total. And tonight you could go home with this set here for $90, <laughs> right? I'm guessing Kurt means this guy. He says that Connor says that one of the guys looks like Stanley. It's like, I'm guessing he's talking about this guy. Kinda. But I like this set a lot. I think it's really cool. It's got a lot of really nice parts in it. It's huge. There's a lot of stuff to the set. Plus, the rocket is so dope. Um, and the gantry crane actually works and everything else, too. So it's got yeah. the nice little hook and everything yeah, else. Yeah, and then this string is actually thicker with a ball joint molded on the string, which yes. is really nice. Really, really nice. Yeah, so it's, it's a really good, really cool set. And of course, like you said, we had a backup because it takes up all four feet of the counter space. So. All right, moving over to lot number 13. All right, lot number 13 from Lego Creator 3-in-1. We have a quadruple lot of species here. So first off, we have this 3-in-1 Tyrannosaurus Rex. You guys have seen here plenty of times before. Yep, we, we have, have the deep sea creatures. Deep sea shark. And, this uh, is the... And all, all these are three in one, so please don't ask like what all they build. But yes, the anglerfish is dope. Anglerfish, and then it should be and a squid. squid. So the deep sea creature pack. And you got we a have dragon, the fire dragon, which can be a scorpion or a dog, like a wolf, saber wolf. tooth. Saber tooth. Yep. And then you have the lion here, which can be a ostrich, ostrich, or a boar. A what? A boar. I'm bored. Uh, bored. Your. Um, yeah, so you get all four of these awesome creator three in ones with all the instructions and extra parts for forty five dollars tonight. Forty five dollars takes all this four one, of these home. I have this one. I have this one. Still one of the coolest sharks I ever made. Yes, yes, and it, you can tilt it, rock it back and forth. Dan, dan, yep, you can actually pose dan, it, and make dan, it swim, and everything else. I love that. makes cool anglerfish too. I want. I need to get another one so I can get the anglerfish. Like this, one. I keep forgetting to get this one up. <laughs> Lou, we actually were thought about doing that, um, but I never got around to it. He says, please tell me the lion has a flower on the behind like the new tiger does. <laughs> no, no, it does not have the flower butthole. We can do that. I would just... <laughs> I thought about it as a, as a gag. 
We could do it because there's a one by two in there. We just need the shelf bracket and a one by one jump. Yep, and put it on there. Totally. Um, and Liam, our buddy Liam, hey, five and first, uh, is joining us down from Disney World, Florida. Disney. So, what's up, Liam? Hopefully, the weather's better down there. What's up, dude? <laughs> Hopefully, <what are> you- <laughs> the weather's always better in Florida. What are we talking about? All right, about? next up here from Lego DC Superheroes, this is the. Batman or the Joker steamroller set, which is like the best part of this set. These and the figures. Yes. This set here is the first ever set you get Batgirl and Damian Wayne in with this awesome purple hat wearing Joker based off the old, old movies. Now we do have to preface that this is a lower price because the Joker and the goon are cracked. Wait, we didn't fix those? Nope. Or else it would be much more expensive. It would be like another 15 bucks. Just as a heads up. Um, let's see, I know him. Bob is claiming lot number 14. Bob Simonetta is taking home lot number 14. Why, do you think if, you, if we have the parts, we can fix them for him? But I don't think no. we have the parts. No. I mean, I have the Joker that I can fix. I don't know about this guy. Yeah. But okay. I... What's up, Nick? Okay, so quick pause here. Nicholas, our eight-year-old, would like to show off some stuff he's been building in the other room. We have a little green dinosaur, and he went off of that one and made a multicolor parrot-looking dinosaur. Rawr. He just wanted to show him off. Thank you, Nicola. So you guys uh, might like dinos and whoever are dino fans? I'm sure a lot of people are dino fans. I bet you're the best. <laughs> dino fans are the best, yes. All right, moving on to lot number 15 from Lego Ninjago. We have... Stormbringer. Hunted season. This here also can be modded with a power function set, which is really cool. Um, we've had it here. Oh, okay. Hold on. I got it. Hold on. Oh, there you go. Okay. We're good. <laughs> All right. So this here is complete. You have the dragon armor here which is one of three parts to get, actually one of four parts, because it's a shield too. You get the dragon bone sword, you get Jay and Zane, two hunters, and check out this guy. And this guy? This, I said two hunters. His, his name is not two hunters. I said two hunters. No. <laughs> one and two, Ryan. I forgot what that guy's name is. Chris can find that out. I don't care what his name is. <laughs> two hunters. They are dragon dope. hunters. And then what's cool about this is the way this neck is built is it's got two stud, or not stud shooter, but spring loaded spring launchers, launchers in his, in in his mouth. Yeah. So if he opens his mouth, there's two blue ones in there. It's a good build. And you can trigger it from behind the head. Yeah, it's a good build. Which is pretty dope. Daddy No Legs. Daddy, yeah, I already, Daddy, what? Daddy No Legs. Daddy No Legs, that's his name? Really? What's the other one's name? Muzzle. Muzzle? It makes sense. Muzzle and Daddy No Legs. Okay, I actually right, have Muzzle at because it's a pretty good figure. Um, and another feature about this uh, Dragon 2 is he's got the little whiplash tail. So you can whoosh, and start smacking figs and stuff with it and start smacking the bad guys. So that's pretty fun. So lot number 15, Stormbringer, with instructions, can be yours for $60. All right, Dave, what do we have over lot number 16? All right. For you Jurassic World fans, this here is an awesome duo lot we have here. Tonight, lot number 16, we have... The where is this? Blue helicopters pursuit. Blue helicopter pursuit. Yep. This is blue. Rah! And then we have the. Oh, where's Nick? We can have him do the. Carnotaurus chase. Check out this Carnotaurus. This thing is sweet. I love the colors on this. It's like chocolate esque. And the Dabrowski sisters are taking that one home. And this is actually based off the Netflix TV series. Yes. Do I hear a raptor in a distance? Oh, there it is. <laughs> Do it again. Do it again. Do it again. Egg. <laughs> what, you made a bird now? I made a custom. Oh, is it like a pterodactyl? It's a custom plane. Is it a ter- oh, it's, it's a plane? It's a custom plane. It looks like a bird. It, lo- it kind of looks like it's ran it on. Tell Speaking me, it doesn't look, you mean it doesn't look like a bird? If you make the wings longer, Tell it's a bird. Tell me that's not a beak. Tell what? me that's not a beak right there. It's not a beak. It's a plane. It's a plane. Boy! Boy! Oh, boy, me! I'll put you in the box! It's my kid for you. <laughs> it's a bird. 
All right, moving on to line number 17. All right, from line number 17, from Nicholas. Creator. <laughs> Get out of there. Nick. Three and one, we have the UFO Amusement Park Ride. The Fairground Carousel. So it has a hand crank, which can be switched out for a battery pack, of course. And it has all these little spaceships that go spinny, spinny, spinny all the way around. And this there's set two comes aliens. With, what? There's this little alien here, and then there's this one with the ray gun. Ah, yes. And this it comes with complete with three mini pigs, ticket stand, ice cream stand, waiting bench, and extra parts. The extra set can parts. also convert into two other sets, including a mini Ferris wheel and, and a, a rocket, rocket ship uh, launch, looks like. Mm -hmm. So, nice cool little set here to go with any little city set or carnival you may be working on at home. We need to sell this stupid cow, cow, cow. Uh, let's see. And yes. So the Dabrowskis are going to go ahead and take home lot number 17. Bob tried to get it, but he was a little too slow tonight. All right. Chris. Da, da, da. Hey, take your plane. Yes. Come on. Bird plane. I really bird plane. Guy. Take the bird plane. You really want this guy? I know you want this guy, but we need to see if we can sell it to somebody else first. <laughs> All right. Lot number 18 from Lego Bionicle. We have here, this is a trio lot. Three different Bionicles. Um, we have. I don't know which one is which. Um, <laughs> actually, this should be Nobok. Because this is like the elder for the Borok. Okay. And we have Hafu and Uri. Uri, Hafu, and then the old guy. Yes. And you can get these three tonight here, this three pack, for $30. Claim lot number 18. All right. Next up here from Lego Friends, both of these can be certified, but we don't want to because they look cool. I like these little cars. Tonight you can go home with lot number. 19 here, we have Emma Sports, Sports Car. Sports car. Yep. Oh, you did that one. Okay. Emma Sports Car, and then we have Mia's Roadster. I'm not going to lie. I like Mia's Roadster more. Which just it, it looks pretty cool. Yeah, so these two little car sets come complete with extra parts, instructions, boxes, and all the other things that you need to complete these sets. Uh, Let number 19 to be yours for $25. Not too bad. And of course, includes Mia and Emma. All right. So, All right. so, before we get to the next half, we have some awesome custom figures to show you. Ryan, do you want to show them real quick here? Yeah, so we had a lot of minifigs in from our vendor, minifigs.me. Uh, we imported these from England. Um, so if you guys are checking these out, we have a full trays full of them. Yes, full trays um, of tons of different figs in here. We have Justin and Susie from Stranger Things along with, uh, let me see who it is. We have uh, Eleven in her black and yellow outfits as well as Hopper in his Hawaiian shirt. Um, we also have the teenagers from Stranger Things. As I'm not going to oh some over. Oh, my God. <laughs> the teenagers from Stranger Things. Um, as well as Max and Billy. We have the cast, uh, Sam Dean and Castiel from Supernatural. We have the entire Avatar collection series here with all seven figs. Not the entire, but the ones who matter. The ones that matter. Except for her. You know. I don't really like her. What? She's mean. She is mean, but she's got lightning. Wait, which is so cool. what? what does so does Palpatine. Nobody really true. likes him Back. either. Um, <laughs> we also have the Chips Ahoy, or the shot, the, oh my gosh, the Scoops Ahoy um, versions. I can't remember the names of them, uh, along with the Star Court signs. Um, you can get those. We also have a bunch of horror movie figs in, including Carrie, Chucky, Candyman, Jeep, the Creeper for Jeepers Creepers. We got Michael Myers, uh, Ghostface back here. We got Jigsaw. We got all sorts of stuff. We got Spawn. Um, Bob Ross, you can't go wrong with Bob Ross and his happy little trees. Um, you've got uh, Back, to the future. <laughs> Back to the Future over here. You got Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. You got some Cobra Kai action going on. Some He Ra, uh, He Man, She Ra. <laughs> you've got uh, Miles Morales back here. You got two different versions of Deadpool. And also Spider Man. And we got a new black and red Spider Man. We got all sorts of stuff coming in this week. Yeah. Um, and they're all here, all available for you guys. All you got to do is stop in and say hi to Dave, and he will show you whatever you and want. Yes, so I will take thing. them out. You can pick the figs you yeah. want, and then we'll go home with you. They're awesome. I, I'm really uh, happy to have We do have somebody asking, are the prices per figure? In most cases, yes. However, a lot of them, like the dual pack of Justin and Susie, and like the um, Back to the Future stuff, these are up for the set. So some of these are... So you uh, get both of these for 40 both of these for 40 both of these for 30 30 right. Anything that is kind of paired up as such, 
Yep. Is what the price is. And then we do still have an old custom from Minifigs at Me, which is Luke with a old Yoda and then mm -hmm. a felt backpack. And then a we also Yoda? have Kurt. And we also and have Mr. Kirk and Spock. We got the original Tron. We Flintstones got the Flintstones and, and the, the Defenders. Defenders for your Marvel MCU fans. Because what are we? What's up? Because certain people are coming back. Yeah. All the, yeah. da, 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 All I think so. I think that's what that was. All right. All right. So I hope you guys are ready. All right. All right. Back up here. One, two, three. Guess what time is it? It's Rewind Recap Time! <laughs> Woo! So here we go. Here we go. All right. <laughs> All right, guys, we're going to go ahead and start all the way back at the very beginning here to any of the lots that have not been claimed. If you'd like to claim them at this time, you may do so. Starting with lot number four from Lego Bionicle, we have <laughs> Chris is farting up around over there. Come on, Chris, lot number four. There we go. Vakama, Matau, Nakama, and Wenwa from Bionicle. You get this four pack here for the $60 if you claim lot number four. Lot number five from Lego Creator, we have the Pirate Roller Coaster, including four, well, five minifigs if you include the uh, Bone Guy. What? Yeah, go ahead. Uh, including a nice long sh uh, shark coaster here that Nicholas is going to go ahead and show off. Make sure you push it from the back, Nick. Push it from the back. Whee! And it goes right back to the home. Uh, you can get this lot here, three and one, with instructions for $90. Uh, Kimberly Dabrowski is asking if she can get the Luke and Yoda. Was Luke, uh, Luke and Yoda was how much over there, Dave? Twenty dollars. So uh, Kim, we, I know you're gonna want it either way. I know the price is wrong, but yes, we will go ahead and add the Luke custom Luke for you. All right. So custom Luke is going to the Dabrowskis. All right. Moving on to lot number six over here from Lego Creator. We have two three and one sets over here: the shuttle transporter and the propeller plane. You can get both of these lots here tonight with instructions and extras for $23 if you claim lot number six. Next up, lot number eight from Lego DC Batman. We have the Batman Tumblr Scarecrow Showdown with the Batman exclusive to the set, Scarecrow, and the awesome Tumblr with instructions. The set could be yours for $40. Lot number 11 from Lego Elves. We have Nada's spa secret here, including Nada and the elusive purple dolphin um, along with the spa with brand new instructions and sticker sheet with extras yep. and a box and instructions for $30. Excuse me, boys. Next up is lot number 12 from the Lego City line. We have the rocket assembly and transport set over here. Uh, includes many, many figures, many, many awesome components here. We have the rocket, the uh, design center, launch center, car, and of course, all eight minifigs. Uh, here for $12, or sorry, for $90, Mike. It's lot number 12 for $90. Lot number 13 we still have available, which is our four-pack of creator sets over here. We have the Mighty Dinosaurs, which is the green one here. We have the Deep Sea Creatures set, the Fire Dragon, and the Wild Lion without the pink flower butt. <laughs> All here for $45 if you claim lot number 13. Uh, the Dabrowskis are asking if they can get an airbender set for $100. Yes, yes you can. We have four of those available, which brings it down to three. So we do have three of those available. And yes, it, it is really awesome and comes with two different heads. Um, Katara and all of them all have their appropriate accessories, which is really, really awesome. Uh, moving on, we have lot number 15, uh, Stormbringer from Leo Dejago. Uh, includes four mini figures here, a piece of the dragon armor, um, as well as Stormbringer the dragon. Um, this lot could be yours for $60 if you claim lot number 15. Moving on, we have lot number 18 from Lego Bionicle. We have uh, Novik, Va, Hafu, and Ire. Uh, we have the three pack of Bionicle figs here tonight for $30. And finally, we have lot number 19 from Lego Friends. We have Mia's sports car, or Mia's Roadstar, and Emma's sports car. Um, these two figs with their respective vehicles with instructions and boxes and extra parts can be yours for $25 if you claim lot number 19. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Uh, we have a claim from Nikki Figueroa for a lot number eight. What was lot number eight? Oh, it's the, the, the tumbler. Nice. 
Nikki, this is an awesome set. You guys will love it. Nikki Figueroa, taking home lot number eight. Yes, yeah, so if you guys want to see any more of those custom figures, just let us know. Uh, we are going to be getting more in stock as well. Um, we also have some of our awesome minifig displays here. We have a little kidney bean displays, a total of 16 figs. Our brand new, um, what was it, 20? 20 figs? I want to say 20 fig uh, gear displays, as well as our um, 18 fig wall mounts and 30 fig three tier displays. We have a lot more retired sets and uh, new unboxed sets that came in, including some extra pirate sets, like legitimate pirate sets, brand new unbox. We have some of our other lots from last week as well that did not sell. We also have a new London set, new inbox that just came in. And then, of course, we have more of our creator sets over there. And yes, we do still have quite a bit of our January 1 releases and soon to be um, March 1st releases coming out pretty soon. Uh, we have a question from Samantha Dabrowski. Can I get a Supernatural set? Let me see here. Supernatural is a $50 set. Yes, you can. We will grab those for you as well. Supernatural. Well, Sandine and Castiel with all of their awesome accessories. And if you if you watch the show, it's perfect because he's got a rock salt and he's got his laptop and they've got their crazy um, drawings over here and his Being Human for Dummies book, which is classic. Classic Castiel. So we will have those for you as well. All right, so let me grab that for you. Uh, just bring this over to Sarah without showing off all the rest of the stuff here. Sarah, we got another one for the Dabrowskis. There you go. Thank you. All right, so we're going to move on to the lot, our second half of our show tonight. Dave, what do we have? Lego. What do we have for lot number two? Oh, lot number two? Lot number 20. All right, lot number 20 here. I need to go down the sheet from Lego DC, the Batman movie. We have Joker's Roadster, and then we have the Cat Cycle Chase. Now, I will say you're getting two Batgirls in this lot, but you could use one of them as like a dummy, like a test dummy, or you could... You know, put a different hat on here. You could use this as a Halloween costume for a figure. Mm -hmm. So you don't have to have both Batgirls as Batgirls. Come on and run on the fan. Because you can lock it, too. <laughs> yes, you can, you can lock, lock it, it down. And then careful when you open the trunk because it's loaded. <laughs> yeah, I love this one. All right. Well, that lot is going to go home with Bob Simonetta. Bob Simonetta is claiming lot number 20. You go. It's loaded with missiles. You got to be careful because if you open it too much, it'll shoot out. All right. Well, Dave's fighting over to launch and stuff over there. We're going to go to lot number 21 again from Lego City. We have the satellite service mission and the Mars research shuttle. All right. So this one here has a little satellite that comes out the center in the back. Or the research shuttle. The research shuttle, which opens up. You get some more of the. Translucent, dual molded. Yep, so that's some of the space rock, the Mars yep. rock. You get a little case for it that hovers. A little drone case. Mm -hmm. And then this, this does a bunch of things. This actually comes off, like, like, and it's a little drone. It's a little drone, and then you take this little red, and you use the, like, 3D, and you Just could like read it, it and, and you read it, and it says H2O and AD, or AC. Yes. So it's chemicals. So there's a lot of cool things you can do with the set. And of course, this goes with the same line as before with the big rocket launch uh, set. Um, and as you can tell, the front of this is very similar to the such front a, of the Such a great shuttle. space line. I, it is. I love this one. It it's is a cool. great job. Like, this can rotate. There's all kinds of play features here. Uh, I wish I could take all three. And of course, just like the new Mars one, you know, it's got its own little I helicopter. Think, see, and stuff I, the funny thing is, is I think I have this one and one or two of the space station at home. But I don't have this, and I definitely don't have the no. rocket launch. Maybe Dave will buy it if you guys don't. <laughs> yeah, no, I can't. All right, moving on to lot number 22. What do we have? Just because I got paid doesn't mean I can buy it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, lot number two from Avengers Endgame 22, not number two. We have the Avengers jet and the upgraded Captain America Avenging Cycle. You get three Outriders, two Chitauri, and five Avengers, even though one of them is a guardian 
he still counts as an Avenger too, because once you team up, you're an Avenger for life. Lot number 22, you can get both of these complete sets with villains and heroes. They could go home with you for a whopping eighty-five dollars. Mm -hmm. And this is probably the best Quinjet they've made. Yes, it is. We've had it a few times here without all the guys, um, but it's a really Opens cool up. Quinjet. It has this nice little vehicle that comes out of the back. Rotates a stud shooter, and then this trike or spider, however you want to call it, and it you can hold a bunch of people in here. Like this opens up. You got two here. You can still hold. One there, one there. Ah! <laughs> I don't know where he saw that. Hold on a second. Uh, first and foremost, we have a claim for lot number 22 from the Dabrowskis. I'm taking home lot number 22. Great. Um, Kurt is asking, how much is the Slave 1 poly bag? Oh, that one? Oh, I was like, how did he see that it? One? That one? That one. Yes, that one $20. is $20. New... This is the Brickmaster poly bag that was part of the Brickmaster Brick Builder series um, that you had to get in the with the magazine. Um, so it was an exclusive, but it is a micro build of a Slave One. So yes, twenty dollars for that cart. Twenty dollars. All right. We also just got that in with all of our other sets that we have. Yes, we did. All <laughs> right. Next up here, lot number twenty-three from Lego Bionicle. This is both Gen One and Gen. Kurt would like to claim it. Okay. Well, go on with Kurt. Looks like Br 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 Bricks and Liam was trying to get a shoe. <laughs> as soon as he's like asking about it, he's like, "Wait, what?" <laughs> Congratulations, Kurt. All right. Bricks and Liam was so close. All right. Next up here, lot number 23 from Gen 1 and 2 of Bionicle. We have Gally Nuba, Gally, and Kopaka, I believe. Yep. And all three of these are complete with their mask. And tonight you can go home with all three of them for $35. $35. Pretty cool. Old gear system. <laughs> Slicing them up. I love that. She's a swimmer. <laughs> this is hacking away at something. Like this is something like kind of creepy you'd see out of a horror movie. The big metal hooks just coming at you like. Wah! It's pretty cool. All right, moving on to lot number twenty-four. All right, if you guys want to go on a safari, check out this. Lot number 24 with extra series figures. Wait, wait, hold on. Um, John is asking, John Dickhout is asking, how much for the brick built Sentinels? It comes with the set with the $55 for 55 bucks. These are 20, 25 a piece. Not kidding. Look it up. Here, let me get a closer view so we can see. Closer view. I love it. Well, I was going to show them the whole set. Uh, yes, they are printed as well. They have printed heads. Printed head, printed torso, no minifigs, and it is slightly modified from the actual set. I can't show that much over there. <laughs> yet. Yes. Yes. Yes, $55 for the two Sentinels and the X-J. Pretty good. All right. Pretty good. Deal. Moving back around. All right. Dun, 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 dun. 24. Well, number 24. Safari, we have the Zebra Safari. Off-roader and giraffe guy, you know. Giraffe guy. What better way to have fun in the safari than dress up like a giraffe? Except when you get trampled. <laughs> yes. If you look like lunch. You also get this awesome tree costume, which is for this guy when you take his hair off. Uh, so you get a little tree tree uh, costume guy. You get the giraffe costume guy. You get this awesome safari vehicle you with the parrot. lioness, um, as well as the female explorer here um, with this awesome. Awesome multi seat explorer set. Um, and you can pick it up here tonight for $22. I like this, but I don't because these are all stickers. Excuse me. Yeah, but they did a good job. Whoever did this did a good job. Oh, yeah. Them. Oh, yeah, definitely. It's just awesome placement. What a minute if these were printed and then people were like, oh my God, I'm getting these and I'm making my whole living room zebra. <laughs> right. <laughs> Wouldn't doubt it. All right, we're on number 25. Dave, what right do we have? Number 25 from Lego Creator 3 in 1. We have the um, Future Flyers. This here is complete with box. Yes, this has been on, on our stream before, but never complete in this, this is fashion. Honestly, this is probably the best one here, this car. It's minifig scale. I, kept it as a Mac. I know you kept it as a yes. Mac. Yes, Chris, Chris, our oldest son, actually kept it as a Mac and modified it with Dave and my help. Um, Getting some awesome bit. guns and stuff bit. with it. And it, yes, it has the extra tires and the windscreen and stuff in here. Too. Wings prop up. It's got these cool 
rotating or adjustable jet boosters. Jets or blasters or whatever you want to call them. It's pretty cool. Whatever we're going to make them. Pretty good set. This thing is old, too. This came out early 2000s. Yes, I was very surprised at how much it went up. Yeah. It's got a lot of gold parts, plus the, the orange parts are always a little more expensive. So. All right. All right. Next up here, lot number 26 from Avengers Endgame. We have the um, Hold on one second. Uh, the Dabrowskis are asking for one more Airbender set. So we will go ahead and get You're that for welcome. you. So two of those. You're welcome. <laughs> You're welcome. All right. Lot number 26 from Avengers Endgame. We have the compound set. Fully stacked with figures like Captain Marvel or the Micro Ant-Man here. We have Nebula, Thanos with, you know, Hammer Time, which I don't know why can't, they gave I can't this. keep lifting it. Just leave it on the thing. <laughs> I can't show that. And then a fully stocked compound. You got a helicopter. You got a loaded Jeep. Cool little garage. Satellite. Rotating door. And then, boom. Rotate on the back. And the wall comes out. <gasps> And it's almost a fully loaded Infinity Gauntlet. You added more. Yeah, uh, they were they were little. Like, <laughs> I need to put somewhere. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I think the Mind Stone's the only one missing. Yeah, which is great because that's what he's after. So. Um, and the, uh, let's see here. What? Oh, there we go. Okay. <laughs> All right. The Dabrowski's are claiming lot number twenty-six. And Nick Smart Gundy move. is asking about the last Airbender set. Yes, Nick, if you missed it, we have our new minifigs.me custom minifigs in. Uh, we have a ton of them, um, including our last Airbender 7 minifig set. So this one includes Aang, Tough. Um, oh, my gosh. I'm having a brain fart right now. Bob Ross. <laughs> not, no, not Bob Ross. No, for Avatar. The other names. Um, Katara, Saga, um, Zuko, Iro, and his sister. I can't remember her name. So, yes, yeah, so we have these here for $100 per set. We also have the Supernatural guys. We have a ton of figs from the horror movie line and um, uh, Stranger Things, as well as Deadpools, uh, Robocop, um, Back to the Future. We got all sorts of stuff up here. So, yes, yeah, so we have a ton of... Ton of custom minifigs that we got in for you guys because I know you guys have been asking about them, um, and when they do it, we do import them from overseas, so it does take a little while. Um, but they were able to accommodate us and actually got them to us rather quickly. So we do have a so bunch of minifigs and soon to be more. We do have a few more that we're getting in. All right. So next up from Lego Batman, we have a duo lot here. Lot number twenty-seven. You can get Batman in his Thrasher armor suit and Ace the Bat Hound. Versus the Court of Owls, or you could get Batman versus Joker in his 1980s style Batmobile by Azula. Far. Thank you, Josh. Thank you. I don't I, care. I love the show. Name I love the show. Just... Azula was dope. She was dope, but I'm just tired of Actually, her. Actually, Azula, I can't remember. Azula had those two friends, like the one who liked Zuko and the one who didn't. Yeah. I like the one the who Yin was. and Yang sisters. Whatever. whatever. Sure, no. Their well, emotions said yeah, it. Right. What do you mean? Um, but the, the one who was more of the circus freak. Yeah. Like, I, I thought her character was awesome. And she was just, like, super stealth, just, like, killing everybody. It was crazy. I'm, I'm not disagreeing how cool Azula <laughs> was. I'm just saying, I was tired of her bull. I, yeah, well, it's Azula. <laughs> it's, I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so the Attack of the Talons and the Pursuit of the Joker uh, sets here tonight can be yours. You get both of these with the instructions and extra parts. And there's a lot And what's of cool, too, parts. is... What's up, Dave? Part of the build, they actually have like an empty part in here. If you lift this up, there's an Whoa. empty divot in there that if you put a plate here, you could put some of his gear in. Okay. Yeah. Interesting fact. I don't know why they did that. You could also put it here, too. I don't know. Yeah. That's a lot of space. I don't know so why they did that. Not, not I, used, I really but, don't know why they did okay. that. But yes, it comes with a ton of extras plus the six minifigs, so you can get it all here tonight for 50 bucks. Come on, this is Ace the Bat Hound, guys. Oh. This is one of the best dogs Legos made. Come on. <laughs> one now. <laughs> Next is Scooby Doo. Crypto is better. Scooby Doo. Scooby Doo's Scooby -Doo's the bomb. Scooby Doo has two. Hey, you know what? If you get a Scooby Doo set, you can grab the Supernatural guys and you can redo the whole scene. Oh! oh. Scooby Scooby Doo. What? And if you guys are Supernatural fans, you know what I'm talking about. Because that was like the best, one of the best. Uh, episodes they did when they did a crossover See, with Super Funny Scooby enough, it's like I'm so behind on Supernatural, I still watch that episode. Though. 
Like, <laughs> no, regardless of what happened prior to that episode, I watched that episode and it was awesome. Yeah, it's great. It's great. <laughs> I love it a lot. All right, letter number 28. Tonight we have Jurassic World. We have the T-Rex Transporter set. This set includes three minifigs. Mm -hmm. Little station here. You can unlock Our this. awesome car. And, of course, the T-Rex. Right, you just... Boom! Just lock him in, Eric. Lock him in. And the sides actually lock as well. You just fold these over here, and then it locks the sides in. So it keeps it all nice and still. And it looks like the Dombrowskis are going to go ahead and take home lot number 28. Sweet. This will go well with the other ones. Yes. Should they clean the other ones, too? I don't know. I don't remember. I want to say yes. Okay. Uh, Lou is asking, was it a live action crossover or a cartoon? Answer both. is both. It was both. Uh, we did have it, like, the majority of it takes place in the cartoon, but then it also does take place, some of it takes place outside of it as well, which is pretty dope. Uh, Jordan Wilner says, I'm excited about the new Jurassic World sets for 2022. So are we. They do look good. I, it's weird that they only showed three. I thought there was going to be a few more. But I do like that feathered raptor. Yep. That thing is sweet. And as well as the fact that you guys should definitely check out the uh, no no plugs or you know like we're not getting sponsored or anything else. Um, but you should definitely check out the Jurassic World Dominion uh, trailer, which is out now too, because it is awesome. Good. You're a Jurassic Real World fan. Preview. So it's awesome. Really I good. I hope that's a pretty long movie. I'm hoping to. I'm, I'm hoping, hoping it's definitely over two, two and hours. I'm hoping two and a half. I'm really happy I mean, to if it. it's going to be the ending, awesome. But as far as I read, it's the ending of the previous or the current. It's, it's the end of all of it. I don't think so. It's it even it even says right, but that's what they want you to think. <laughs> uh, head directors and stuff were whatever. posting saying whatever. Do other stuff. We'll see. Lot number twenty nine. What do we have? Dave? Show on Netflix too. Let's get it. <laughs> whatever. What do we have? Just, I don't know. What do we have? Lot number twenty nine here. This one we have had here before. Uh, this is a great set. This is a great set. I know. I'm going to pick it up. And, yeah, I got it. All right. So this three-in-one beach set, you could turn into a little... Um, lighthouse? Lighthouse. The tugboat? I do like the tugboat. The tugboat's pretty nice. The you have stingray. a like, beachfront <sighs> yeah, it's resort like a, almost. Yeah, it's like a resort. And, and then you have the, the little um, surf shop. Which we are showing you the inside of it because you can actually just pull that back and close it up. All right, you can close it this and way. Boop, you it's can a whole fold shop. it this way and have it a corner. Like this thing is sweet. Yes, yeah, so we've had this one on the show before, uh, but this one is complete, complete with all the instructions, all of the extra parts, all of the minifigs and the extra turtles and everything else. The um, turtles. So you get this entire set here tonight for thirty dollars if you claim oh, lot man, number I mean, twenty nine. This is a corner build too. It is a corner build. It can be. Pretty nice. I like mix. I like seeing people mix these with the, the modulars and stuff too. Like just have that different well, yeah. size range. Yeah, it works out really it's well. It's a great, great way to do those. Um, and Kimberly Dabrowski is going to claim lot number twenty nine. So it's going. All right, moving on to lot number thirty. Uh, I don't want to show this one yet. All right, all right. You're gonna have to. You're gonna all have right. to preface this. How many and, people we got here right well, now? Well, there's a little over thirty people in here right all now. Right. And I will say, for anybody who is a fan of really old, kind of creepy, awesome stuff. You should copy paste that whole claim thing in right now, because uh, you are. This is the first time this has ever been in our our shop. It will likely be the last time it is ever in our shop. So if you want it, it's time to get it now. I mean, yeah, we <laughs> haven't had anything from this theme since you opened. We've seen maybe a couple parts, but none of the sets have been in. We made a, we, we've, these we've, sets aren't even like officially Lego. Like they're Lego company, but they're not from a Lego store. We've we've also cracked a lot of jokes about this. Yeah, I mean, this is the goat of Lego. If anybody knows what that means or is, you guys will once you see. All right, so all five of these are from McDonald's, but they are Lego. They're part of Lego's line. You could look them up. Just like how a Bionicle started. Right, just how a Bionicle started. And now they're like $30 a set. So all five of these, complete set without their books, and it is from Lego Galador. Wait, what? What? What did I say? Chris, Chris what did I just freaking say? Galador, everybody. All five of these are from Galador. We have all the figures. So we have... Um, I think the set is Eden, missing one. Nick, Eden, no, it's only five. Well, because there's one set number that's, that like jumps around in the list. Well, it's because of how they... Um, they haven't lined up with the okay, actual okay. sets. Gotcha. It's, I don't know why, but okay, as far yeah. as I know, there's only five. Okay. Um, give me a moment here. I'm going to read the names because I wrote them down. Oh, you did write them down. Yeah, so we have Nipo. Nipo. I know that sounds weird. 
We have Europeanus. We have Which is Gorman. A- I know. I know. Don't you remember? <laughs> this is why this is part of the reason why it didn't sell, okay? It's, it's not- well, guess what? It did sell because Brixton and Liam is gonna go ahead and take on this one. <laughs> yes! Yes! <laughs> All it's right, so, so so what what are the names one more time? We're gonna go All right, so we got <laughs> just gotta do it. <laughs> Evil, your penis, or your penis, I don't know. Gorm, Jens, and Nick. See, Jens and Nick, I'm fine with those. Gorm, eh. but then these two, it's like who the brook who the brick named these guys? And funny enough, at one point we had like one of his arms. Right, but we've <laughs> had the store. funny enough, we've had these two staffs here in bulk. I've seen this one oh, yeah? three times. Oh really? Since we've been open. Yeah. But well, we've um, never had all the things here. Yeah. But congratulations to Bricks and Liam, who is finally gonna take them all. Congrats to you. Woo! This is the goat of Lego. It was by far their worst selling product line. And but hey, I'm gonna ask you another question. You know how to make uh, Galadur go extinct? Snap him away with this awesome Infinity Gauntlet. Right, right. I wasn't going to do it that way, but yeah. <laughs> yeah. So this here is a complete built Infinity Gauntlet. And we threw in this little micro fighter in Gauntlet. Look at Like father, like son. <laughs> <laughs> yes, this lot comes complete with instructions and the original box with all six stones these should have been actual crystals and not freaking plates but and you can get this lot here tonight lot number 31 for 50 dollars before it's gone and it looks like the lewis family colin lewis is gonna go ahead and grab lot number 31 <laughs> this is awesome it actually looks really dope because it's all it's all metallic gold which is which pretty is nice. And it's not it's not pearl gold, it is all metallic gold. It's pretty nice. And I'm actually I'm kinda curious how much all those parts cost individually, because it's probably a lot. Not really. No? no. Probably metallic. It's like the only thing they come right, in. But it's a it's a sixty dollar set. Yeah, whatever. true, I know, but I'm just saying Iron individual, individual prices could be yeah. different. All right, Dave. Right, what do um, we have over here? Lot number thirty two. Lot number thirty two is oh, hold on, I'm a little I'm a little crooked right now. A, Give me one a, second, hold on. A, I got I got nothing here. I gotta what fix the, this. Hold on. What the, right here? There was something right Chris, there. Wasn't there something pretty big over here? Yeah. It was, it <laughs> Hold was on a second. <laughs> Just as a funny thing, uh, Bob Simona said, I claim lot number 32 for blank. <laughs> I think it's just getting ready. Literally blank. Uh-huh. Just, just blank. This is what it is. This is what you want. No, I'm kidding. No, I'm kidding. This is what it is. It is a practically certified. No, certified. Practically, pra- practically brand new. Practically brand new, practically certified. Because a couple of the bags were open. Yes, there were what seven, eight bags, eight bags, eight bags open eight out of bags 30. Open. <laughs> uh, 33. Yeah, something like that. 33. Yes, this is a 5,500 piece set. This is a current set, but as Dave said, we had eight bags that were open. We double checked it three, four times technically to make sure that all the parts were there with the, the stickers and everything else. And you can pick it up tonight oh, here for $30 under retail. You can get the Camp New FC Barcelona set here with the box and instructions for three nineteen. Be pretty cool. What? It's pretty cool. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So if you are interested in taking home those stadiums, we had one before and it sold, and now we have the other one. Right. Yeah. We have the orange Barcelona. We have the same too. Same time we have. Then we have the other one. We have the the Manchester United. Yep, so that one sold already. So this one will be here if nobody wants to claim it tonight. But lot number 32 is yours for $319 ole, if you would like to claim it. Ole, ole, ole. <laughs> ole, ole. All right, last but definitely not least, we have our three awesome mystery boxes. All three of them are fitting in the themes we have tonight. And in order for you to see what is inside all three of these boxes, you got to claim first. So you can claim lot number 33 for $5. You can claim lot number 34 for 10 or lot number 35 for 6. These are great. I so built 5, one of them. 10, or 6. 5 I for green. one of them. Ten the feet. other two were already built. I just had to build a figure. Uh, they're awesome. I hope you guys like them. Uh, we have Bricks and Liam claiming lot number 33 for $5. Easy there. 
Yeah, it's his cool three and one creator monster, monster truck, truck. Set crushing car with instructions and extra parts. Sweet. Congratulations, Bricks and Leah, for lot number 33. Next up, we have Samantha Dombrowski claiming the yellow box for $10. All right, Miss Dombrowski, Ooh. you get this sweet rescue helicopter with newly built maces. Awesome. Sweet. And last but not least, Lana. Hold on. Hold on. I'm waiting. Uh, and the other Dombrowski claiming the red one for $6. You get this brick built canoe that was an in shop build with minifig. Yes, and special instructions. And yes, it is an official set. See? Woo! Kayak. <laughs> All right. Congrats to you. All right. So that means we have one more time for our recap here tonight. Also, before you do a final recap, we still have some somewhat holiday themed Ooh. gifts here. Valentine Easter picnic. We have plenty of kiss, kiss, Batmans kiss Batman in, in this exclusive dual flower set here. So we have a rose and a dandelion. Yes, so we have some other cute little sets here for the holidays if you want to pick up something before Monday. Um, plus, we also have some Easter sets available here as part of our do a box series Easter that we have. Sets. Um, <laughs> We uh, we also do have a bunch of other poly bags and extra minifigs we've been pushing out. Dave put out like another 35 or 40 minifigs as well today. In Star um, Wars. In Star Wars. So we have a and bunch of other and stuff. Marvel. Uh, Star Marvel Wars and too. Marvel I put out. Okay. Uh, Bricks and Lame is asking how much for the chick. The little chick here is $12. $12. If we weren't selling Lego, that'd be weird. Right. How much <laughs> for the chick? <laughs> All right. So, other thing is, is Dave. Um, isn't Sunday something, or is it this Sunday or is it next Sunday? Next no, it's, Sunday is it next Sunday? It's the 20th. You're here with Quinn. Oh, right. No, yeah. It's, yeah, Super yeah. Bowl Sunday. But, and next then you have Sunday. the Unilog meeting this weekend. Right. Next Sunday is... Next Sunday, Minifig the 20th, Spotlight. is Minifig Trade Night. Uh, so I know for those of you, it's going to be a pretty good one. Yes, if you guys want to... Especially get some... if that one guy comes in, if he's watching right now, if he comes in, it's going to be a pretty darn good... Yes, bring nice. your figs because there's going to be a Complete ton of figs hopefully here. And the more you bring, the better. Yes, and it's next Sunday on the 20th. Not right. the Sunday, but next yeah, Sunday. Next Sunday. Um, we also want to let you guys know, of course, we have all those custom minifigs uh, that we were showing off earlier. If you guys want any more of those, please see Dave or Quinn over the weekend. I will be also here tomorrow night. Um, right. Does that up. mean people can trade towards those as well? Um, they are minifigs, so yes, technically. Mm. Sweet. So. All right. And Crab, well. Crab said, I will be there. All right, dude. Ryan, see wraps. Ryan and see wraps. Kryn will see you then. All right, so we're going to go ahead and do one more final recap over here, guys. Rerun recap time! <laughs> if you guys have any other questions or see anything else in the back that you guys would like to see, let us know. And by the way, as we said, we kind of redid our friend sets um, and a few of the other ones over here. We also have a space section now, as well as a Technic and large vehicle section. We have some of our architecture sets in here with some of the other Bionicle lots that we took in. Um, and then we also moved our Duplo over here to a much bigger section uh, so we can get some of those out. So we do have a lot of stuff moved around. Um, but as for our recap, we're going to go back to lot number four over here. We have this bionicle lot over here with Bakama Matau, Nakama, Nakoma, and Wanua uh, here for $60. Lot number five is our Creator Pirate Roller Coaster set here. Uh, this is a three-in-one for $90. Uh, we do have a quick question here from Jeffrey Gillespie asking, how much were the Kirk and Spock and Michael Myers fig? Michael Myers is $20. Um, Kirk and Spock, I want to say were 40, but let me just double check here. Yes, <laughs> Kirk and Spock are $40 indeed, and Michael Myers is hiding back here for $20. Next spawn. <laughs> okay. All right, going to move around, and yes, for anybody who's dipping out of here, Thank you guys for watching. Have fun this weekend. Make sure you guys are staying safe and, uh, you know, partying correctly, partying safely. Uh, lot number six here, uh, continuing on with our recap, is our shuttle transporter and propeller plane from the Creator 3 and one series. Uh, we have both these here tonight for $23. Moving on down, lot number 11, we have Nina's Spa Secret set here from the uh, discontinued LEGO Elves line uh, for $30. 
Jordan is asking, how much is Edward Scissorhands? Edward Scissorhands is $20 as well. Many of the individual figs are $20 unless they are yellow face, um, which is most of the other uh, Lego horror movie figs like Carrie um, and uh, Cannibal Lecter. Cannibal the Cannibal is over there as well. Um, lot number 12 over here from Lego City. Uh, we have the rocket assembly and transport set for $90. It includes everything. Moving on down here, we have lot number 13, which was our creator four in one. We have the Mighty Dinosaurs set over here, the Deep Sea Creatures, the Fire Dragon, and the Wild Lion set here, all for $45. Lot number 15 is the Stormbringer set here with four minifigs from the Lego Ninjago line. Includes a piece of the dragon armor. 100% complete with instructions for $860. And then moving on to lot number 18 from Lego Bionicle, we have... Uh, Nuvak Va, Hafu, and Eri for thirty dollars. And lot number nineteen, we have Emma's sports car and Mia's roadster from Lego Friends with boxes and instructions for twenty-five dollars. Moving on down, and Dave, we have a question about the new Star Wars figs we got on too, so we'll get that over in just a second here. Hold on, we'll, we'll get there. We'll get there in a second. Uh, lot number twenty-one uh, from the Lego City Space Line, we have the satellite service mission. In Mars Research Shuttle sets, uh, we have these complete with instructions for $30, including three minifigs and both shuttles. Ooh, very swishable. Yeah, right? I don't know why they couldn't mount that on there. That's easy. Just put it two bites. Letter number 23 from Lego Bionicle, we have Gali Ka Kopaka and Gali Nuva for $35. You need all three of these minifigs. Letter number 24 is a safari lot here with the giraffe guy from the Lego Movie 2 series. Um, you can get this set here tonight with the instructions for $22. Lot number 25 from Lego Creator. We have our future flyer set here. It is currently set up in the um, mech pattern, but also comes in the little jet as well as a car. Has all three books of instructions and extra parts for $35. Right. Yes, Dave, 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 what? Wait. Anybody want a TV? It's TVs. got a scary movie on it. Ooh, creepy. Huh? Anybody? Anybody? That's just a hint for another figure that's coming to us shortly. Lot number 27 is still available, which is the Attack of the Talons over here, and the Pursuit of the Joker. You get both of these Batman DC superhero sets for $50. Pretty nice. And that's it, except for our big old Camp New, or now, no, new, I think it's new. Uh, the FC Barcelona set here for 319 sets. $319, sorry. Yes, yeah, $319. Um, you can get it here tonight. Only eight bags are open. All the rest of them are still factory sealed with instructions and un, um, stickered stickers. Uh, we have it here for three hundred nineteen dollars. Uh, we do have a claim in here from Nikki Figueroa, who had a claim earlier for lot number twenty-seven, which is a Batman lot. She's claiming that one for fifty dollars. Congratulations to Nikki nice. claiming lot number fifty. That is a good one. Sarah's so working on that. Um, and uh, Chris was telling me about is uh, one of our things that we're sponsoring here tonight, or sponsoring today, is the musical Anastasia being performed by the Romeville High School um, choir and band, of course. Um, this is going to be held on these dates, starting March 4th. Uh, and we, Sarah and I are going to be going to one of these as well. Um, it's my alma mater as far as high schools, and we're happy to help sponsor their events over there as well. <laughs> you know what? <sighs> Quiet, Raider. <laughs> Raiders. All right. In the meantime, make sure you guys check out our sister stores, uh, Cyber Fun Day events on Mondays uh, from our Plano and, uh, oh my gosh, Plano, Texas, Salt Lake City stores, and then Loveland as well, all air on Monday nights from, I think it starts at 6 o'clock our time. Oh, 6 o'clock your time. 7 o'clock our time. It goes until like 9. Time. It's time zones. What are you going to do? You, but it's literally, he literally <laughs> does the same thing Whatever. every week. Catch the shows on Monday. If you want to see other, have a chance to get some more awesome stuff from other stores, follow them on Facebook. Look and it up. You'll see all of them. Look it up. You'll see what they got. But they are only on Facebook, so you need to check them out on Facebook. They do not have YouTube. Yes. So you must do Facebook. Right. The, uh, the Book of Faces. The Book of Faces. <laughs> That's right. Yeah, well, they're not doing so well right now. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> um, anywho, we have a lot of the new stuff that's going to be coming in the store. We have a lot of the stuff that's going to be going back into the uh, March cases. first release date. Some other custom figs, series twenty two figs. Yep. Um, yeah, series twenty two figs will be here next week. Um, we thought we no, we got those all today, so we don't have to worry about those. All the, the other many things. No, we didn't. Other than that, other than that, you know, come see what the what new stuff we are we have. We have out. more more January one releases coming in. That was a good restock. Some, some restocks. we haven't had, such as Star Wars. Yep, you got some more Star Wars sets coming in. Finally, <laughs> a little bit, just a couple, L- little bit, a little, just little bit. Just a couple things. Um, so thank you guys for watching. Uh, we will be here again next Friday, seven thirty. Man, I feel Normal like time. Friday comes quick. It does. Like, I feel like when we do this, like, I especially, because I'm up here on screen, I'm like, it's Friday already? Yeah. What? And what's funny is I was double checking, and I want to say this is like episode 74. Really? And I was going through it all. So next week's our 75th episode? I have to double check. We've been doing it for a while. Especially with uh, viewers on our 75. On our 75th. Yeah. Uh, 75th? Yeah. TH? Um, Log meeting tomorrow night. Log meeting is tomorrow night. Yep, you know log meeting is tomorrow night. Because what what are, what are we what are uh, what are we in Unilog getting ready for? Brickworld. Brickworld. And, and, and another thing that I planned, finally. Oh yes, yeah, the other thing. Yeah. Yep. So we'll have to announce that at a later time once we have that solidified. It's at a place of reading. There you go. Um, but yes, if you guys are also interested in Brickworld Chicago or anything involving that, please let us know. We'll be happy to answer any questions you may have. Um, registration, if you're going for all five days this year, is $75 this year instead of 65 as it was three years ago. Um, so we, we gotta will make be, up the difference. So. We will be going. We'll be having a good time over there, trying to do a lot of stuff uh, for you guys and having some fun for ourselves and just, just having a good time. So Brickworld Chicago in June is going to be awesome. And then Brickworld Indianapolis, I know, is coming up in March. So that's coming up around the corner. So that's it. I think that's the only thing I got. You got anything else, Dave? No, come in and visit me and our new staff member, Quinn. I will also be here Monday a little bit with Ryan. So come in, visit. And uh, if you guys have any new and new in box or built out of box sets, especially licensed like Star Wars, Marvel, DC, bring them in because we're looking for those. Yes, we are paying. We are Star paying Wars. extra for Star Wars. Right? Yeah, Star Wars. We will pay extra for. And Lord of the Rings. Because, ooh, and Lord of the Rings because those flip. Star Wars and Lord of the Rings. We'll be paying extra for. Uh, so, by all means, if you're looking to trade or get some good cash, bring them in. Or find people who are looking to bring them in because we'll help them out. We need the Star Wars. Yes, and as a side note for those, uh, because I know some people are still pretty busy, please, please, please do not spoil any kind of Boba Fett details. Give them, give them at least another couple days. Give them, give them the weekend. Too late. <laughs> So, um, yes, uh, good night, Jordan, and everyone else. Have a great weekend. Night, Enjoy guys. Valentine's Day. Enjoy the Super Bowl. Have fun. We will see you guys next Friday. Go Bears. And if you lose a bet for the Super Bowl, <laughs> don't hurt nobody. <laughs> yeah, sure. All right. Have a good one, guys. We are out of here. Adios. Bye, guys.